The attitude inside the courtroom today was that no matter what happens here in Austin, this likely isn't the end of the road for the case. And the judge says that this law, which effectively creates Texas's own immigration system, could be destined for the Supreme Court. Tonight, the fate of one of the most divisive policies from the Texas government is in the hands of a federal judge in Austin. And if Thursday's arguments are any indication, Judge David Ezra appeared skeptical at best about the implementation of Senate Bill 4. That law passed by the Texas legislature last November would create a state level criminal penalty for illegally entering Texas on top of the federal level criminal penalty. Texas law enforcement would then have the authority to detain and in some cases deport undocumented migrants. Attorneys with the American Civil Liberties Union, one of the plaintiffs in the case, alongside other immigration advocacy groups, as well as the Department of Justice, say the law is unconstitutional. The state of Texas cannot intrude in the field of immigration enforcement, the entry, and more importantly, the deportation of human beings who are here to seek safety. Attorneys with the state declined to comment on Thursday's hearing, where Judge Ezra was notably cautious to approach the legislation. He expressed concerns over the implementation of the law and its impact on the American court system. For example, if the Texas law were to go into effect, what would stop other states from enacting their own versions? Doing so, he says, would create a sort of confederation of states, not the federal United States. That's a weighty argument, and nearly everyone involved in the case indicated they're prepared for this case to go to the higher courts, including the Supreme Court. There's a real willingness on the part of uh, the gov Governor Abbott and, and his administration to continue testing boundaries here. I don't think there's any reason to think that we're going to get any kind of final settling of the issue this week. There's no timeline for a ruling, though Judge Ezra says he plans to issue his decision on whether or not to stop the law from taking effect in just two and a half weeks as quickly as possible. Notably, neither side really delved into the concerns of racial profiling over this law, instead focusing almost entirely on how this law will impact the court system. In Austin, Michael Atkinson, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.